Hello everyone, this is Luxury PL38. Today's unboxing is from Hermes and no I did not get this from the store. I also didn't get it from online because I was trying to get it online but it's just so difficult. I actually went down to a reseller's market and I purchased this at a slight premium. However, it is what it is unfortunately and that is the receipt that it comes with. It is an online purchase with the online receipt. I'm also going to do a comparison with the Chanel wallet on chain in terms of the sizes but I don't actually have the what fits comparison yet because I haven't actually used this. This is a true unboxing first time I'm seeing it it's actually very small this is the Kelly to go and it's supposed to be the wallet on chain versions for Hermes and it is brand new conditions um, the receipt is actually from January 2023 so that was just over a month ago so let me show you the color. This is in Epson Blue Sophie. The stamp itself, let me just show you. It does come with the strap removable. It is not adjustable, but um, it is removable. And what you do is there is a two holes here that you basically just put it through put it in there and this is in the gold hardware the stem is actually all the way here so for someone that is curious of where the Kelly to go stem is it's actually here it is the U stem so that's basically 2022 and I'm just going to do a comparison in terms of the wallet on chain with Chanel. As you can see, with Hermes Kelly to go, there are two different separate compartments, pretty much like the Louis Vuitton wallet. And for some reason, they have the zipper pocket here in the middle. So there are certain restrictions on how thick you can put items in here because of the two different compartments as opposed to Chanel wallet on chain it's pretty much one big giant compartment so you can actually put in a thicker items you can put your phones and your um, small card holder however in here you have to divide the two items separately you can put your phone here but you can't put anything else and the other compartment you can put your coins or your lipsticks, your lip balm, even the card holder. So because of that reason, the thickness is very restricted as compared to the wallet on chain that actually expands on the thickness. So that is the difference and it is a huge difference. This is more like a true wallet as in the design itself. However, if you look at the two compartments at the back, they're very tiny. It's pretty much useless. You can't put anything in here. And we have two compartments at the front as well, which is pretty much useless. You can't put anything in there. If they actually make that into one single compartment, at least you can put your credit cards in there. But at this time, they are just pretty much useless. You can't put anything in there so the comparison with the Chanel wallet on chain it is taller with the Chanel wallet on chain likewise although the Kelly to go seems to be longer but if you look at the side that is a deceptive length because pretty much it curves inwards so they are pretty much the same length thickness wise as I have explained earlier, it seems to be wallet on chain are thicker simply because it is one big compartment. Whereas in terms of the Kelly to go, it has been divided 
into two separate sections and there is a limit of how much you can stretch it out as opposed to the wallet on chain you can actually stretch it out much much more wider so i would say the wallet on chain definitely fits more items you can put in more in in terms of that other than that thank you so much for watching if you do have any questions or comments please do so in the sections below